Here we are today with Graziella, Renita, Hi. and hello. hello. Gian what, what's Gianluca. Your? Gianluca. Gianluca. Hello. I'm already forgetting his name. Today we're here, as you can see, the beautiful Comino. No people. In, in summer it's, it's full of people, it's jam packed, there are like ants everywhere. Today it's very clear and we're going round and trekking and showing you what we'll find on the way. Shall we go? Yes. Let's, Let's go! go. Nothing. We're going near that hole over there. And here we are near that window. Wow. Beautiful, eh? Sun is shining now, and we're walking. Wow, this beautiful weather, this beautiful scenery. You can see. Whew. Come over to Malta and visit these beautiful places. Now we are searching for La Tabla Saaf or something of the sort. I think it should be some, somewhere here. And we found Ar Bla Saaf. As you can see from, from the boat, from the sea, you go in and you see this beautiful view. Look. We arrived near this tower here. Renita, a bit of information about this tower. So this is called St. Mary's Tower. Uh -huh. It was built around 1618 um, by the Grand Master Winya Court okay. and it served as a communication between Cittadella and Gojo and Demdina. Cittadella over there and Demdina on the other side. We're going around the tower, as you can see. It's amazing. And look how high. Imagine trying to creep up the wall. You wouldn't manage. Great defense. Now we're leaving the tower and going to the isolation hospital. Let's see what's in that hospital. What about the jungle, Gianluca? Well, the isolation hospital we see here was built in the late 19th century uh, by the British troops in Malta. Okay. The idea was that any troops arriving from countries stricken with uh, Ebola, uh, plague and cholera would arrive here, spend a treatment uh, or session of isolation here. And it was then later used uh, during the First World War, where any German prisoners of war were kept here. As well. As well. Good. And I think it was used uh, as a residence as well, later on. Um, because I heard some, some other vlogs and they were saying there were rooms, people living, there was a school or a store somewhere. It could have been, could have been. there is no formal um, information to state that, but you know, the, the population of, of Comino changed over the years. Sometimes there were up to 100 people living here, sometimes okay. 20. Working here, maybe working in the here, fields? Working here, yes, in the fields. At, but today there are only two left. Yes, only two people left. And they take care of our Comino. Thank you very much.
exploring this this place there's a cannon here maybe from the the Saint Mary battery we'll be visiting so guys here was something which interested me I removed these and I think there is some sort of shelter or something down there I'm going down come come Hello. It's a, it's a small, it's a small cave. It's a small hiding cave. You see? Wait. There's the entrance there. Maybe in case of air raid or something, they would be hiding here, or maybe they were uh, attacked. Let's go out, let's go out. See you through adventures further and beyond. Here is the residence of the only two people which are still living on this beautiful island. A very quiet area. I wish I would live here, away from all the hassle. As you can see guys, behind me, there is some kind of afforestation or something. There are these kinds of things. They've planted uh, shrubs or, or trees, even there, all over, you can see, very nice. Behind me, there's a, a, a tomb or a memorial of some John Gall, 1911-1989. So maybe he was buried here. Rest in peace, dear John. I was doing some research before coming here, guys, of course. And I found that there are some caves here. Not many people know about them, maybe. Look there. Those caves. Let's see them closer. And possibly, maybe we can go next to them as well. Whoop. Look guys, can you see? We're going up those caves now. I think there's another cave down here. Maybe those of you who are visiting with a canoe, canoe can visit these caves as well. And then they're there. One small thing guys, don't forget when you subscribe on our YouTube channel, Conrad Nirgat, of course. Near the subscribe button there's a bell. Press the bell and you have three options. Select the first one, all, and that would entitle you for a notification as soon as we load every new adventure. So subscribe, press the bell and press all. All of you. Here we arrived. St. Mary's battery. Let's go in, let's visit and share this with you guys. Let's go. As you can see, 
flackert hier. 